welcome back to fun with fusion 360 and a happy independence day to all of my indian viewers watching this video in this video i will be designing the exterior body of a fighter jet plane none other than the hl tejas so let's get started uh, this is the jet which i designed yesterday it took me at least uh, two to three hours to do this we don't have so much time here now so i think i will do a part version of this I won't be including the missiles as well as these guide rails in the wings. Other than that, I'll try to complete everything. So let's get started. Uh, I'll go to create form. I'll go to cylinder. I'll go to this plane. Make a cylinder. I'm not into dimensions totally. So I'll take how much ever you want. You can take how much ever you want. I'll say OK. I'll go to edit form. I'll select uh, this edge. This will be near the exhaust port. So I'll just slightly scale it down. Then I'll choose this one. I'll choose these sets of edges. I'll press Alt and move them. Again, I'll scale this down to zero. This will be the nose of the jet. I'll say OK. I'll go to Insert Edge. I'll select this edge. I'll insert an edge here. I'll say okay. I'll insert another edge here. Say okay. So now to create the front fuselage, uh, I'll go to edit form. I'll take this vertex. I'll pull it upwards. I'll take this, pull it upwards. Just try to make a good shape. I'll say okay. No, wait. I'll go to the left view, I'll select these edges, make sure that uh, mirror symmetry is on, I'll say ok, select these edges, go into my left, just increase them, looks good, I'll say ok, now uh, I'll subdivide this exactly. Okay. Just increase it a bit. Say okay. So now let's make our wings. Go to edit form. I'll go to my top view. I'll on only transition, translation, I'll alt and translate it a bit. Then I'll deselect these both. Again go to the top view. Again translate. I'll say okay. So let's create the edges now. Make sure you've created all the edges. I'll say okay. I'll go to the top view. Go to edit form. I'll select only vertices. Select these both. Pin it down. Say okay. Let's scale the wing size down. It looks good. 
I'll just subdivide simply. Okay. Go to my front view. Edit form. Upwards. Again upwards. Delete. Towards the right. these edges here so okay go to edit form Scale it down. See, okay. See if the there's no any errors. No, we don't have any errors. Good. We can go back to our create form. this hole now so that will get a body I'll say finish form so let's make the windows I'll go to create sketch I'll create a sketch in this plane use the line tool I'll cut the nose I'll say finished sketch. I'll go to extrude option and select the both planes. I'll say symmetric. I'll say new body. I'll say okay. Say combine target body, tool body. Operation will be intersect. Keep tools okay. Again, combine this one with this one. Intersect okay. We'll separate these from the main body. So I'll go to target body as full bodies. I'll say cut. I'll say okay. 
can see that uh, separate bodies have been made. Body one will be your suitcase, body two will be your front counter, body three will be your open. Then I'll go to split body. I'll select this body. I'll say okay. You see that a new body is made. That will be your nose. I'll hide all these. I'll hide the sketch. So now let's make the exhaust port. Make the exhaust mode. I'll say create sketch. I'll move it in this plane. Create a circle tool. Here. I'll say finish sketch. I'll say extrude. With a taper angle of minus 10. Operation will be new body. So now let's hide the main body. And uh, let's shell this out. To a 5 mm thickness. I'll say okay. Let's make some grooves here. Let's hide all other bodies. I'll go to a rectangle tool, two point rectangle tool. I'll go to new copy. Like the sketch, I'll rotate it to around minus 10. So I'll be tapered it at minus 10. I'll say okay. I'll say finish sketch. I'll go to extrude. I'll extrude this. Distance will be symmetric. Just cutting it will cut this body. We'll hide the other sketches which are not required. We'll go to circular pattern. We we'll go to features as extrude, axis as x axis, quantity around. Let's bring the other bodies back. Let's go to move and copy. Just select body files from the front view. I'll say okay. So we are done with almost everything. Let's create the components. I won't be making the missiles or the light test because it takes again too much time. Create components from bodies. Let's rename it. This will be our main image. We are uh, grounded class. This will be our openable. We are close. Very close. Now you can see that. Uh, the fuselage should be grounded. The grounded class should be a rigid group with respect to the body. Okay. Ground glass is done. So the nose will come out. Exhaust part is also a rigid group. So the shell is sitting out here. Okay. I'll go to joint. Again, let's use the joint, the nose here. Okay. So you can see that you uh, can remove the body like this. Very good. 
So we are done with the plane body. So let's start with the rendering. Good appearance. Right glass. The ground glass. I'm glad you opened the White flowers. Some grey for my footage. Thank you so much for watching this video. Hopefully you guys have got a rough idea on how to design a fighter jet body using forms as well as sketches. If you have any other ways of designing it, do list them out in the comment section. You can also follow me on social networks. The links are in the description below. I will be coming up with more designs in my next few videos. Do like and share if this video helped you in designing and don't forget to subscribe.